Hi there. Now for this question then, you had to prove that sesh squared x was identical to 1 minus tan squared x using the hyperbolic functions that we've got here for shine x and cosh x. So as you can see, I've worked my way through this to prove it. I don't think it's that involved, but I'll just take you slowly through. Um, we start off with the right hand side here, well I did anyway, purely because I felt we had more terms here. Um, it's easier to get to the left hand side which contains one term. So starting with the right hand side then, tan squared x, same as shine squared x over cos squared x. I pick up on these two results here and you'll notice that when you square them and divide them the twos will cancel out. So I, that leads me to this result here. And then put it over a common denominator of e to the x plus e to the minus x all squared. Simplify this expression, okay, and you should find you get this result. And that leads to 2 squared all over e to the x plus e to the minus x all squared. And we know that 2 over e to the x plus e to the minus x will be 1 over cosh x. So we've got 1 over cosh x all squared, same as 1 over cosh x squared, which is sesh squared x. Okay?